Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. We're doing the floor. So, if you're gonna be adding a floor into your van, you're gonna be doing something similar to me at the moment. Now, fortunately, I had the old floor for this van. So I can use it as a template for the new floor. If you haven't got a template, I've been looking for that. If you haven't got a template, then you can use cardboard and masking tape, cut it all out, mask it all up, bring it out, lay it onto your new boards, uh, trim, draw around it and trim it out. But I'm gonna be using the old um, flooring, as I said a minute ago. Right, so what I've used underneath my floor is some Doldo Thermaliner Mat, available from most automotive shops. Uh, got it from eBay, nice and cheap. Um, there are lots of places out there, but it will add their little bit of on anyway, so you don't want to be doing that. Right, um, so I've laid this down. Let me show you here. So I've managed to lay it down. It's something you want to do almost last. Um, I'm jumping the gun a little bit because I haven't quite finished, but you want to do it last because if you put anything on it, <laughs> it just rips up. Um, so it's a bit of a pain in the butt. So you want to be doing it last Right, so what I'm gonna do is a first for me is a time-lapse now I've never done one before Haven't got a clue, but I'm literally gonna time-lapse it now I'm gonna tell you what I'm gonna do now and then we'll just crack on so I'm gonna lay my boards down on the floor I'm gonna get the old boards. I'm gonna stick them on top. I'm gonna draw around it I'm gonna grab a jigsaw. I'm gonna cut it out. I'm gonna plonk it in and then I'm gonna screw it down simple as that in it right so <coughs> this is the first bit so you want to just get it in. Oh, hang on a minute. Yeah, boy. Get it in to sit you. Well, uh, rip it the floor. Uh, and we'll get her pushed over. I think I'll get in here for that. It's like a glove. I'm gonna take that back a little bit in a mo. Right, let's get the next bit cut, and then we need to cut a little panel that goes in the front. So this is the last bit. Um, I'm just gonna start drawing around it as we're talking. What I've got on here, which I'll show you now, just down here, so obviously it loops round the metalwork, down in that corner and down in that corner. So what we're gonna do is just straighten this bit up. If I can get my pencil to work, just along there, look. And again, down here, just like that. So we're gonna cut around this. And we're gonna get a nice, straight, oh, bit of crappy floor, look. Let me put you down for a second. We're gonna get a nice straight cut through here with a circular saw. So.
Sweet. I don't know what the time is on the video, but that literally only took a few minutes. Right, so now I'm gonna use some self-tapping screws and I'm just gonna go around and I'm gonna secure it into place. And that is the floor pretty much done. All I've got to do now is pick the floor that I want to put on it and go from there. So join me soon for a video where I'm going to go through five of my favourite things to do with the bus. Stay safe people and I'll see you soon. Bye bye now.